Right now, police asking for help finding the person who broke into the American Legion Hall in Gray and made off with some cash. Cumberland County Sheriff's deputies say someone cut the phone lines, broke into the hall sometime overnight Saturday into Sunday, and cut open a safe and an ATM machine. Officials are not saying how much was actually taken. The New Hampshire man accused of tracking his wife across state lines and trying to kill her will be in court today. Gregory Owens is set to stand trial for December's violent home invasion in Saco. Prosecutors say Owens shot his wife and then the friend she was staying with both survived. The state's Department of Health and Human Services is getting $800,000 from the federal government to support substance abuse treatment and recovery programs. Maine Senators Susan Collins and Angus King say the focus will be helping Mainers between 12 and 24 years old. And a reminder tonight, you'll have a chance to hear from the Republican presidential hopefuls in a special commitment 2016 voters first forum. It is live right here on News 8 from 7 to 9 p.m. 14 GOP candidates will be discussing the issues from St. Anselm College. Thanks for tuning in to this News 8 update. I'm Norm Karkos. Make sure to check back at our website and our News 8 mobile app for the top stories of weather anytime. Have yourself a great day.